Hi, I'm Leslie Allen. I'm the owner and principal author of Rational Realm. In this video, I want to share with you what we were about and why we set up our web portal. From a very early age, I wanted to know how the world worked. Looking up at the skies, I was fascinated by the nightly display of lights in the heavens. And closer to home, I wondered how plants grew, where lightning came from, and how we evolved from earlier life forms. But is this world all there is to know? In my teens and early adulthood, I was increasingly intrigued by people who held divergent worldviews. My years at university challenged me to think about the limits of reason. What is the good life and the nature of reality? My wide-eyed wonder and questioning stance still goes on, all these decades later. This curiosity is the driving force behind my establishing Rational Realm. I want to share my interest and the interest of our authors in these big questions of life and the universe with other like-minded souls. You can find our website at www.rationalrealm.com. The website focuses on both the philosophical and scientific questions. A key area of investigation is exploring the intersection between these two spheres of human inquiry. At this boundary between science and philosophy, our authors ask questions such as these. Does the apparent design of the universe lead us to religious belief? What does recent research in artificial intelligence and neuroscience tell us about the relation between mind and body? Can science reveal the world as it really is? Or is it just another belief system among many? And are we free to make genuine choices? Or are we simply complicated automata? Let me now take you on a quick tour around the Rational Realm website. To find Rational Realm, just type www.rationalrealm.com into the URL or search bar of your favourite browser. Here on the home page, you'll see that our site is divided into two key sections, philosophy and science. In the philosophy section, we explore four key areas. Epistemology is the philosophy of knowledge. Here we ask, what can we know and how do we know it? What are the limits to knowledge? Does science give us a superior way of knowing? In metaphysics, we explore the fundamental nature of existence. We inquire about the relationship between the mind and the body and ask about the nature of God. Does the presence of evil disprove the existence of God? And do we have free will? In ethics, we discuss the foundation of morality. Is ethics objective or subjective? We also examine practical moral quandaries, such as whether abortion is ever permissible and is it right to eat animals? In logic, we ask about the relationship between logic, mathematics and language. Are the laws of logic laws of thought or something else? Simply click on an area to go to it or select it from the main menu bar at the top of the page. Let's go to the ethics section. In each section you'll see a list of contents for that section. When you see uh, an essay or a resource you like, tell your friends and colleagues about it. You can easily share it on Facebook, Twitter, Google and other social media portals. This breadcrumb trail near the top of the page will always show you where you are on the site. Let's go back to the home page to see the other sections. The other main area is the science section. In this section, we explore physics, biology, mind and religion. Physics is the study of nature, examining such things as how objects change and interact and how the universe began. 
what are the basic constituents of matter and how do fields and forces work. In biology, we explore how species evolve and the role of DNA in inheritance. At the level of the individual, how do cells divide and how do organisms grow and develop. In mind, we ask about the role of consciousness in evolution and how the mind is structured. What are the determinants of personality and what are the conditions for living a happy life? In religion, we take a historical, psychological and sociological perspective on religious tradition, sacred texts and personal belief. In both the philosophy and the science sections, you'll find a mix of articles. Some are specialised and explore a particular aspect in depth. Others are of a more general nature and not requiring any specialised knowledge. You can also make use of the, uh, the philosophy and science glossaries uh, in each of those areas. Uh, now in these glossaries we explain terms for which you may not be familiar. Other sections of the site you may find helpful are our list of resources, reflections of our authors on a range of current issues, and book reviews. Now make sure you're kept up to date by subscribing to our newsletter. By subscribing, you'll be notified when we add new material and make updates to the website. Don't worry, we won't inundate you with emails. We'll only contact you when there is a change and we won't send your contact details off to any third parties. We respect your privacy. Over here, you can learn about our authors. Our authors are an eclectic mix of academic and non-academic writers. They come from a range of backgrounds and interests. Do you, have, uh, do you think you have something to say that may be of interest to our readers? Well, if so, contact us using our contact form on the website. We'd love to hear from you. Well, that's the end of this short tour. As well as our main website at rationalrealm.com and our YouTube channel, you can also find us on Facebook, Twitter and Google+. Check out the web addresses at the end of this video. Thanks for watching. We're progressively putting up short videos on a range of topical subjects, so be sure to keep an eye out for them.